Hello, welcome to Last Film Barbecue. As some of you might remember, I mentioned over and over again, both at Thanksgiving and Christmas, that it was really hard to find turkey here. But guess what? I did. I went to a store that sells uh, frozen turkey. So um, I bought some turkey uh, legs and uh, I'm gonna brine them and I'm gonna smoke them. Uh, and I'm actually gonna treat them like large uh, chicken drumsticks very large chicken drumsticks. These are about 2.2 pounds each. So, yeah, anyway, I'm gonna put them in some brine. It's gonna be very simple. Two teaspoons of regular salt and half a cup of brown sugar and some bay leaves. And I'm gonna leave it like that until this afternoon. I know that that's not really long enough, but yeah, I forgot to put them in the brine yesterday and I won't eat them today. So time, time to make the brine. As you can see, I'm using two tablespoons of regular salt, half a cup of brown sugar, and four bay leaves, and then just whip it together. Okay, so I've just washed off the turkey legs and I've put them in a plastic bag or a Ziploc bag. I'm going to pour the brine, which looks like this, after being totally dissolved into there. And there we go. Time to put these cold until it's time to put them on the smoker. And based on the fact that it's winter, this is a cold place. I'm gonna leave this here for, I don't know, four hours. It should be okay. And then I'm gonna disrobe my ugly drum smoker and probably smoke them on that or maybe use my kettle. I haven't decided. Meet you back in a bit. Okay, so it's uh, a really nice today today. No new snow. This is a few days old. Anyway, uh, I'm gonna go for a walk, so I just lit some lump charcoal in here because uh, my greenhouse where I keep my briquettes is snowed in and this was easier. I'm just gonna have a quick cook anyway. So I'm gonna leave this uh, to start up and then I'll meet you back here in whatever, 45 minutes or so. This is running at about 275, 300 or so, so that's good. Um, I've got the, uh, the drumsticks or the turkey drumsticks. I'm gonna prepare them. I'm gonna wipe them off, season them up with some kosher salt, oregano, smoked paprika, black pepper, and uh, garlic powder. Just gonna mix it up and use a little bit of oil to, to get it to stick. And then I also brined some uh, chicken wings because I need to feed part of the family before the rest so I'm gonna start them at the same time even though they're gonna be done way for before so I'm gonna do this and I'll let you tag along okay so we put that to the side and then we're gonna start off by getting these little turkeys out of there I'm gonna get rid of that all that just gonna pat them dry with a little bit of paper I have no idea if this is the right or the wrong way to do this, but it's the way I'm gonna do it. Maybe like so. And we're gonna put a little bit of oil on there. These don't really take that much prep, do they? And then, like I said, it's um, three tablespoons of smoked paprika, two tablespoons of oregano, uh, one tablespoon of kosher salt, two tablespoons of um, garlic powder, and one tablespoon of black pepper. Just mix that together. Like so. And then we're gonna get that on there. Just get it everywhere. And on that one. There we go. So we're gonna put that onto the pit. Okay, so we're gonna get some wings out. This has been out in the cold for a long time. I use the same brine that I used for the turkey for this. Not sure if that's gonna be good or not, but it's gonna be the way it's gonna be. Just take a couple. Then I'm gonna do what I've seen so many other do. I'm gonna take these apart 
into a drumette and a flag. All gone in there. There's only one to go. There we go. Okay, so I'm gonna wipe these off just a little bit. Get some of the water off of there. Okay, so there we go. I think you can see that. Uh, we're just gonna put some oil in there. That's two tablespoons. Move them all around. So everyone is coated or each one is coated by a little bit of that. And then we're gonna put the seasoning in there. Put half in there, move them around. Put the rest in there. And there we go. I think that's good enough. This is what they look like before. And below you have the little turkey. Anyway, okay, time bit. to make a glaze. So I've got half a stick of butter. I've got two tablespoons of Inferno hot sauce, two tablespoons of tiger sauce, and three tablespoons of bourbon. Just gonna let that melt, adding the rest in there. Then it's time to baste. Because the wings are done, or almost done anyway. There we go. Okay, so I just tried this and I realized I need some sweetness in there, so I'm gonna add about one tablespoon of honey. I think that's enough. Meat okay, bread. let's take a look. It's been about an hour and 30, 35 minutes. I basted this twice. Yeah, they're looking nice. I'm gonna take them off. And there we go. It's kind of nice to me. How about that backdrop? Maybe if I put them on the snow. Yeah, I'll take a picture like that. Okay, so the wings are done. I'm gonna try these. Before they're eaten, these were really good. Oh, that's really hot. Good thing I didn't make them for my wife. Okay, I'll be back in a bit with the turkey. Okay, time to make the glaze with the turkey. I'm gonna be using half a stick of butter for that as well. Three tablespoons of It's Incredible Rub from Heaven Made Products. Two tablespoons of honey and two tablespoons of uh, bourbon. So. Let's see what's in here. Yeah. I think they're starting to look nice. So I'm gonna baste them with a little bit of the baste. Then I'm gonna leave them on here for about 20 more minutes. Okay, so it's been another half hour. Time to look at these. Yeah, oh, this smells divine. Uh, I'm gonna take them off and bring them inside and I'll show you what we have. Okay, so let's cut into this. I'm, like I said, never done this before, so I'm just gonna follow the bowl. Something like so. There's some kind of thing in there. And then, let's slice this up. Oh, there is um, some connective tissue in there. I'll move that to the side. Hmm. Apparently I'm gonna remove this as well. Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm gonna try it. Okay, so let's try this. My first turkey leg. Hmm. That had a lot more juice in it than I originally thought. Tastes really nice. Um, it's not that strong of a flavor of anything, but I can taste the bourbon or smell it at least. 
Mm. That's really good. I'm going to make a salad. Thanks for watching. Bye.